So we're back, we're still in the grind to the Juju show, but if you haven't already watched the first episode then I recommend watching that before you watch this one, that would make more sense. Just in case you aren't aware of what I'm actually doing in this series, basically I'm trading from nothing i.e. wheat to a Juju short bow, then giving it away once I actually get it. In the first episode we made some good progression and we made just over 2 million coins in the first episode so you can't really complain with that. Anyway today's progression should be much quicker, hopefully anyway. Anyway, without further ado let's get into the video, I hope you enjoy. One more thing before we get into the video, for those who do want to be entered into the actual draw for the Juju short bow when I actually do get it at the end of the series, then leave a comment with your IGN in the comments of this video and basically I'll just randomise all the comments until I find one that has an IGN on and that'll be pretty much how I actually pick the winner. So I'm back in my office, i.e. the AH. So there's no time to waste, I'm just going to get going with some flips. So the first sniper of the video are these Shadow Assassin boots that I picked up for 1 million coins and at the moment they're selling for around 1.17, I could probably get slightly more for these uh, just because they do have 3 stars um, but I think I'm just going to actually just list them for basically lowest. Within about a minute, these have sold. Uh, I do realise I probably could have got maybe even another 100k for them, but I just wanted to get the sale quickly so I can get the coins back in my account. And we've picked up some more Shadow Assassin boots, this time for 1,090k. And they are 3 starred, um, so I'm probably going to relist them for, I don't know, maybe like 1.2, 1.15. And we just sniped another pair of 3 star Shadow Assassin boots for 1.1, and I think I'm going to list them back up for 1.16. So one of our pairs of boots have sold, so we'll collect that, get a little bit more money in the account, and then we can start flipping again. So we've just picked up here a last stand book for 200k, and at the moment, they're going for around 248k, so we'll take that. And we've just picked up a wisdom book for 140k, and we can sell it on for like 160k, so that's not too bad either. And we've just picked up another last stand book for 199k, and we can sell it on for around 240k-ish. And we've also picked up another last stand book that we can sell on again. So we picked ourselves up a spicy raid racks for 150k and it's got a potato box on it and it's pretty much fully enchanted for the sort of people that are going to be buying this. Um, and the cheapest one that I've seen that's similar is probably this one which is 600k. Mine hasn't got full hot potato box so I'll probably list it for like 500k. Um, maybe slightly less, we'll see where we get. Now I have actually gone ahead and bidded on three aspects of the ends. Um, I'm not sure if I'm actually going to win them, but if I do, then it's a bonus. So it's the next day, and it looks like all of our items did actually eventually sell. Thankfully, that uh, that actually sold. That made a nice bit of profit off this Raiders Act. So we'll collect all of our coins, and then if you remember, um, we did actually we actually ended up winning one of the aspects of the ends for 110k. So that's going to be a nice like 60k profit there. So we'll collect everything back, and um, yeah, we should nearly be on 300 mil. 300 mil, nice 300 mil. So the current price of the aspects of the end is around 165k, so I think we're going to list those for like 162 or something like that. Uh, we'll make just over 50k profit. And within about a minute, our aspects of the end has sold. Um, so yeah, we're on just under 3 million coins. Um, pretty much we've just got to get back on with the flipping. So what I think we're going to do at the moment is we're going to buy 9 Ancient Roses and craft it into Flower of Truth. Uh, if my calculations are right, we should make a few hundred k off it because Flower of Truth is quite high at the moment. So uh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and try and snipe them if I can. I need eight more. So we've gone ahead and bought our nine ancient roses, and the current price of the Flower of Truth is 3.25 million. Now we actually only spent 2.77 million coins on this, so we should be making around 500 k profit, just slightly less. So can't really complain with that. We're just going to go ahead and list it up. And after around two minutes, our Flower of Truth has sold. And we are now up to 3 point, nearly 3.3 .3 mil, so it literally was a 500k flip, give or take, maybe like 400. Can't even remember how much I was on actually, to be honest, but three, four or 500k, can't complain with that. I think we might do a few more of these flips. So we've got ourselves another 9 Ancient Roses, and this time we spent slightly more on them. We spent 2.9 mil, um, but that should still be around 300k profit. So it's been around 5 minutes and our flow of truth has sold, so now we're up to 3.5, nearly 3.6 mil. Um, this is actually a really good flip. And this time we spent way less, we spent around 2.55 million coins on this, so this should be around 800k profit. So after a couple of minutes again, our flow of truth has sold once again, this time for slightly less. Nevertheless, we're just over 4 million coins up now. So I think we're going to bid on this flow of truth for 4 million coins. It's 4 star and it's got some decent enchantments. We're going to bid on it, we're going to test our luck. We're probably not going to realistically win it, but um, yeah. Hopefully we win it. Probably not going to happen. So it's been about an hour since last recording. I've tried to get on the skyblock and um, it's done for me since at the moment. I can only assume the new update's coming out very soon. 
Um, so I'm going to have to cut the episode short, which I'm a bit annoyed with. At least we made around 2 million coins profit. But yeah, like I was saying, I was hoping to make like a good, at least 5 or 6 million coins. Um, but yeah, it's quite annoying. Um, I guess in tomorrow's or tomorrow's episode, the next episode, uh, which should be coming out in the next couple of days, um, we need to check on our auction to see if we won that. And other than that, we need to really crack on. But anyway, like I said, I'm sorry about the short video. I can't really do much about it. But if you did enjoy the video, make sure you do leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you next time.